Hi, I'm Morgan from Cardi Game, and in this video we're going to show you how to do a fisherman's rib. She's a fancy little rib technique. She's really bougie and soft, but she's not anywhere near as hard as she might look. So you can see here that we've already done some fisherman's rib. Every row is the same, except for your first row. So to start your fisherman's rib, you're going to do one row of just purl stitch. And then for every other row, you do one purl, one knit, one purl, one knit, one purl. Um, but basically how you get this sort of fancy rib stitch is by knitting into one stitch below. So every row, we start with a purl stitch. So you bring your yarn to the front of your work and do a purl stitch. And now we'll show you where the fun starts. So to do this fancy fisherman's rib, rather than knit into the top stitch like you would normally, you're actually going to do a knit stitch into the stitch below. So you can see here, you slip your needle in and there we've caught that second stitch and then you do a knit stitch like normal. And so then you bring your yarn back to the front, you do a normal purl stitch like this. And now bring your yarn to the back and it's time to do another one of those knit one below. So here, instead of putting our needle in the top stitch, we put it into the one stitch below and then do a normal knit stitch like that. So like we said, other than that first row, which is all purl stitch, every row is knitted in the same way. So it is quite simple once you get the hang of it. Um, the chunky yarn definitely does help to see that row below. But if you start every row with a purl stitch and then knit one below, you will be off and racing with your fisherman's rib.